it was a young man who, you know, he wanted to make a lot of money, and so he went to this guru, right? And he told the guru, you know, I want to be on the same level you are. And so the guru said, if you want to be on the same level I'm on, I'll meet you tomorrow at the beach. The young man got there at 4 a.m. He all ready to rock and roll, got on the suit. He should have worn shorts. The old man grabs his hand and said, how bad do you want to be successful? He said, real bad. He said, walk on out in the water. So he walks out into the water. Watch this. When he walks out into the water, it goes waist deep. So he's like, this guy crazy. So he said, come out a little further, walked out a little further. Then he had it right around this area, the shoulder area. He said, come on out a little further, he came out a little further. It was right at his mouth. My man, like, I'm about to go back in here. This God is mine. So the old man said, I thought you said you wanted to be successful. He said, I do. He said, walk a little further. He came, dropped his head in, held him down, holding him down. My man didn't scratch it, holding him down. He had him held down just before my man was about to pass out. He raised him up. He said, I got a question for you. He told the guy, he said, when you want to succeed as bad as you want to breathe, then you'll be successful. I don't know how many of y'all got asthma here today, but if you ever had an asthma attack before, you short of breath, SOB, shortness of breath, you wheezing. The only thing you're trying to do is get some air. You don't care about no basketball game. You don't care what's on TV. You don't care about nobody calling you. You don't care about a party. The only thing you care about when you're trying to breathe is to get some fresh air. That's it. And when you get to the point where all you want to do is be successful, as bad as you want to breathe, then you'll be successful. He said, I got an opportunity to make a dream become a reality.